Right away, your heart goes out to our next mm -hmm. guest, Anita Draper. She has been in physical pain consistently mm -hmm. since childhood. And it certainly wasn't for lack of trying different treatments, but only after Nuka did things change big time. And Anita's here alongside Dr. Drew Drummond of Spinal Balance Health Center. Good morning it's to nice both to of you. Nice to meet you. Good, good to see you again, Dr. Uh, Drummond. Anita, good to see you this morning. And Thank like you. we were saying, this, this went on for decades. Yes. What were your symptoms? Well, severe migraines. Mm -hmm. Sometimes I would lock up where I couldn't move or like my left side would shut down, you know, things like that. I would lose my balance a lot, but for the most part, it's mostly pain mm -hmm. all over. You How know? did it affect the day to day as a child, as a teenager, as a young adult? Well, as a kid, I didn't get out and do too much mm -hmm. when I would hurt, you know, but you know, as a child, you try to be active and involved with other children, but you don't think about those things when you're a kid, mm -hmm. but as an adult, it began, like when I became a mom, um, there were times where I'd had to lay in bed and fix sandwiches on my tummy mm. Mm. so my kids could have lunch, you know. Oh, Anita. The pain was so, that severe. Oh, yeah. I, my back would lock up, you know. Well, you just couldn't well, physically stand. Where I could not get out. What had you tried? Obviously, you know, experiencing pain for so long, you had to have tried certain treatment mm -hmm. options. Yeah. What did you try? Um, I went through shock therapy. I did, uh, they did um, scans like MRIs and EKGs and all kinds of stuff like that. And then mostly... Um, like muscle relaxers, mm. um, uh, what are the things called for inflammatory? Anti-inflammatory? Mm -hmm. Yeah, mm -hmm. um, things like that. So you know. pills and treatments exactly. galore. And nothing worked. What happened after you experienced Nuka mm -hmm. treatment? What did you notice? I noticed that I could <laughs> cross <smiling>. my leg. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and it's crazy. I can sleep on a pillow now. Mm -hmm. I used to have to sleep flat because it would hurt to sleep on a pillow. And now I can sleep on a pillow. <laughs> <laughs> Look at the these little things. things. The, the oh smile God. on her face. You yeah, can you've tell got a great you smile. Like you couldn't cross. I mean, we're just, I mean, you mm -hmm. take some of these things for, for granted. granted. Right. You, you couldn't right. cross your legs. Well, yeah. So you noticed a difference. Oh, yeah. Definitely. Pretty close to right definitely. away yeah. within a month. How yes. long did it take? Oh, I don't know. Maybe like a couple weeks. Wow. It was that yeah. soon. Dr. Yeah. Drummond, for our mm. viewers who are thinking, Nuka, what is this word? Yeah. How could something be so effective when she'd tried everything else? Yeah. Explain it for us. Yeah, she'd, um, she tried everything except fixing the underlying problem. She'd done mm. a lot of symptomatic right. treatments, um, but nothing that got her nervous system functioning better. And our, we've got this great innate intelligence inside of us that's designed to heal and maintain our bodies um, in a natural way. And there are some underlying structural problems that can get in the way of those processes. And until you figure those out, you're, you're stuck. And with her, she had a misalignment at the top of her neck. The first cervical vertebrae is a very common misalignment. And when that bone is out of place, it interferes with normal transmission of the nerve, nervous system between the brain and the body. Mm -hmm. And what NUCA does is a very specific correction to that bone that restores then this nerve, n normal nerve flow like you're seeing um, on the monitor. Mm -hmm. uh, and then the body just starts functioning better. We, we have all these... Um, these innate expressions that are supposed to work normally in our bodies yeah. and when they don't you end up looking like Anita. In Anita's yeah. case though I mean you've had a lot of patients come on our show and talk about some of the pain that they were going through yeah. but I don't recall somebody uh, like Anita that had been battling these issues since childhood, early childhood. Yeah, yeah. I would suspect maybe a birth trauma, some childhood accident or injury. There's no way mm. of knowing what it was that caused that bone to become misaligned. Mm -hmm. But once it's misaligned, unless you have another accident that misaligns it in another way or somebody corrects it, mm -hmm. you're stuck in that position where the nervous system isn't functioning right. Um, it'll throw your posture off. It'll, it'll do all kinds of different things. She crossed yeah. paths with a number of professionals over the years. Yeah. Yeah. Why is it that just in general health professionals are overlooking that bone that can make such yeah. a difference? Right. Um, we've learned so much about the body and in any in any schooling, there's so much to learn, it can't all be addressed. So the medical doctors have med school where they learn how to treat symptoms with medicine. Mm -hmm. Physical therapists have their school, surgeons have their school. There's only one profession that deals with the top of the neck and the vertebrae and getting them aligned to fix the nervous system, and it's chiropractic care. There's nothing else that does it. And then even within that profession, there's a small group of people, there's 200 that do it, I two to 300, that really focus on this type of chiropractic mm -hmm. care to fix the top of the neck. So it's just not a message you're going to get from people that don't have the schooling. You know? There's a lot of people out there dealing with, with pain. Mm -hmm. um, how, how can you, they tell if, if they're really dealing with a misalignment in, in that portion the, of their The skeleton? most common thing that I see in my, the most common nerves that are involved 
are the ones that control the paraspinal muscles um, of the back. So when the atlas is out of place, this segment of nerves or this grouping of nerves will be affected and it'll cause one side of the back to tighten more than the other side. Um, and then a person will have to adapt to that imbalance. Mm -hmm. Like you can see on this picture, the right one is a person that's nice and balanced. The left shows how muscles will tighten on one side. And what that does, it creates uh, essentially a short side to the body that you have to adapt to. So you stand on what we call a physiological short leg. And when I look at somebody, I can see it. I can see it in their head uh, tilt. I can see it in their shoulders, their hips. Uh, but ultimately, it's taking an x-ray and finding out you know, geometrically what that misalignment is doing and then mathematically calculating for each person how to fix it. Anita, would you recommend Spinal Balance Health Center? Absolutely. Mm -hmm. no. Yes, ma'am. <laughs> and her yeah. smile says it all, doesn't it? And, and, and I have to tell you, I went to a chiropractor about 15 years ago just as a visit with a friend. And I was just checking out their little monitor mm -hmm. thing. And he said that there's a lot of stress in this area. And he comes over and he pushes my head down. And I'm like, really? You think there's stress? Oh, okay. <laughs> mm -hmm. If it wasn't before, it is now. It is now. Right. 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 This is a very different form of right. care. And so anything that you think you know now, uh, it might be worth calling and looking into seeing how NUCA care as a specialty is different. And in fact, Dr. Drummond brings us a special offer so that 15 of you can try it to see if you have the same experience that Anita has had, even if you haven't had pain since childhood, um, but you're just tired of hurting, whatever it is, call 452-3400 or log on to spinalbalancehc.com, but you will need to call to take advantage of that special offer. Yeah, Anita, awesome. good, glad to see you're doing so yeah. well. Thank nice you. Nice to meet you. Yeah, thank Dr. Dr. Drummond. Have a good hey, week. Thanks.